in America we have rights. Yet people think their rights to their lives include rights to other people. It doesn't. Relationships are based usually on laughter, light of the Lord, and love. But when one side is an abuser, when one side is actually a user, when one side is a liar, when one side is a thief of information that never discloses what they've gained through solicitation, then maybe, just maybe, they're out of the house of God. You see, everybody wants to say, I am holy, you are not. I am worthy, you aren't, won't be. But the truth is, all in God's house are worthy of God's situation. They were put apart of the Lord's creation. But the truth is, they still choose to sin against God's plan. God's plan was that person to meet that person. God's plan was that male soul to meet that female soul. God's plan was those two friends would get together and make the Lord something new until the end. But God's people abuse God's word. And God's people who abuse the Lord's word are always trying to tell people what God is saying, interpret what God is meaning, and the truth is most of them have no background to interpret the word. They listen to the word, they get an impression of the world, they like to imply what they get from the word, but they're not thinking what they look like to the Lord's house. The Lord's house has many rooms, I often say. It's something that is consistently said to me through the channel of the Lord. Chapter 10 in the book of John explains to us again and again the position of the Good Shepherd, the gift of the Holy Ghost to our lives, and yet people want to insist that someone who listens to God, who cares about God, who tries to evangelize people about God, is somehow a sinner of Satan. The foolishness you are is that you want to be like me. You want to have God's dignity. You want to have God's grace. You want to have what you cannot have because you're not willing to bow your knees and show, show not shine your face. What I mean by that is that when we pray, we have to be willing to get on our knees every day. But most of us aren't able to do that as we age is somewhat true, but many people refuse to do it because they want to be the God over you.